name is Jillian Cartarelli. I'm originally from a small town outside of Boston. Um, my major is fashion design. I'm a double minor in global studies and product development. Um, so the title of my collection is Dysmorphia. And this basically means like viewing the body in an abstract and, and disillusioned way. So like the, the main goal is creating and creating this collection was for parts of the body to be concealed, whereas other parts more tight and revealing. So I was inspired by optical illusions and the way they confuse your perception of something. Um, so I also wanted to create like confusion within my collection um, with parts of like uh, the garments exploding from the body or just like drooping off the body. Um, as well as like the print that I made is sort of like based off an optical illusion so it also like confuses your perception. Um, and I also wanted to show like the juxtaposition between like revealing and concealing with different um, fabrics like organza and wool. Is that I use a bunch of different manipulations uh, in order to achieve a more abstract garment. So I use things like subtraction cutting and slash and spread just to add like fullness and everything um, and then I also created my own sleeve so stuff like that really um, makes an interesting collection. Originally I was in art, fine arts, so I had no idea about fashion until my senior year of high school. Um, and then from there, I kind of realized I wanted to go into fashion. I didn't really think about it. Actually, one of my um, relatives was like, you should go into fashion design. So I was like, sure, if art's gonna get me nowhere, <laughs> um, I'll try fashion. I want to have my own label in the future, but I definitely want to build myself up before that. So be in a company, see what goes on in the fashion industry, and then branch off from there, definitely. Um, I know there's definitely a shift in um, recycling, a shift in upcycling. Uh, a lot of people are going to thrift stores now rather than buying new fabric. And there's also a shift in people wanting to buy better quality um, fabrics from smaller companies that are sustainable um, rather than fast fashion. And even though it's more expensive, it's worth the cost most of the time rather than uh, just damaging the environment more with fast fashion.